it's staring though. Yeah. It's just, it just feels so weird. Right, right. It's breaking. It's <laughs> breaking. Go to the other side. Ah. It's the front. Hey guys, welcome to my channel. It's the world behind the camera and I truly appreciate that you are here with me today. You know, today I'm in the P-Series LT. I've already driven the LS. Actually, I've walked around the LT. I've done a video on that already. So this is going to be based on the test drive basically because the time that I was do at the time that I was doing the other video, I walked around the LT but I test drove the LS. So today we're going to be test driving the LT and we're going to be trying to test all the features of course we're not going to be able to cover everything here but we're going to test as much as we can so one thing i need to tell you about this video you know i gave a disclaimer when i did the h6 pov unfortunately i'm coming with another disclaimer because i have some flickering that is happening on the instrument cluster I hope it's not going to throw you off. The information is still going to be there. Believe me, I'm going to be driving with Bruce. It's going to be like interview kind of style, but it's going to be quite an interesting. I really enjoyed making this video. I hope you're going to enjoy it too, because we're going to be testing like a lot when it comes to the features that this car has to offer. So yeah, without further ado, then let's just hit the road then. Ah, uh, see what's what. Okay, let's go. Straight down over the mountain. The only thing you'll feel now is it's going to warn you if you go across lanes. Okay. The, so it's the, the, the LS doesn't do that. For yeah. You. So it has. Does it have the same system as the H6? Exactly the same as what oh, you okay. felt in the H6. No. Oh, even the adaptive cruise and adaptive cruise as well. Give you a warning if you're too close to a car yeah. in front of me. You've got all these fancy things. Turn up fan. Okay, I've increased it to speed two. <laughs> okay, okay. How much can it do though? This voice assist. It can do the basics. Oh, but just remember, sometimes it's going to pop up. And it's going to be because you press that button over there. So don't press this button because this is the voice activated button as well. Oh, okay. Okay. Nice. No, because yeah. in the in the H2, it only works on the what is this? When you connected the the, the, the couple? Yeah. Yeah, but then it's Siri working. It's not. Yeah, it's not necessarily the 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 system it's not in the, the car. System, yeah. It's so this Siri. is the the lane. That's a lane showing you that there was something in your blind spot. You see yeah. that, yeah? On the side, when that and car is comes, coming. And then when it gets next to you, it'll go off. Then it's off and on. Oh, there okay. Oh, I see. You did the down your descent control last time as well. Huh? The, yeah. 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 Down it. gearbox huh? I I love this gearbox you know I was in a BT50 during the week the new Mazda BT50 I, I feel totally different right now that's that's the thing and I'm realizing that actually this gearbox is just I like ZF is something else eh? yeah ZF I mean I'm a rock runs it now well that this is the old one oh, okay the new one is the 10 speed the new I'm a rock gearbox oh the the, the V6 yeah 10 speed auto. Mm -hmm. It's ridiculous.
but the H6 is nice. Mm. But the funny thing is this engine, maybe because it's a diesel, you can feel it working compared to the H6. Yeah, the H6. The, the thing with the H6 is it's very responsive, but it's because of the power of the, the, the engine. Petrol. Yeah. But one day is one day when I've got an all-wheel drive, then you'll have to come drive the all-wheel drive. Yeah, because that one, you it know, drives it's different. Mm. Oh, that's a phone. I was like, yeah, oh, what's that? Right. What's that? What's that? <laughs> it, it drives different to the two-wheel drive. The two-wheel drive, when you put your foot down, is very light. Like, yeah, because because you well, immediately you put your foot down, wheel spins easy. Mm. Where the all-wheel drive is pulling on all four wheels, oh. it just gets the power down, and you and go. And then you go. I can imagine that 150 kilowatts. Do you feel it running against compression? Yeah, like I just left yeah, it now. Manual descent control. Because oh. I just left it now, but it's just yeah. maintaining, like trying to maintain around 60. Yeah, it's it's running your high revs like you would do mm. with a manual car. Yeah. You just stay in this lane, so don't go to the right. Just stay so you're going to go straight, straight, straight. Okay. That was my wife. See, oh, because that car was too close. It's ah, you, you're too close to that car. Yeah. Did you see it on the dash? Mm -hmm. Mustn't drive so close to the car. The car doesn't <laughs> like it. I'm using the cordless charging. Oh, it's, yeah. it's oh, okay. Yeah. Does but your this phone one do cordless charging? Oh, uh, yes, it does. Okay. My phone is full, so let's put you oh, on Yeah, it should activate soon. There it yep. is. It's working. There's a person who asked me about Android Auto. I see there's Android Auto in there's here. Android Auto and Apple CarPlay. Oh. Remember, it, in the re, in the original course, it was only Apple CarPlay. Yes. But since then, we can go one lane across. Since then, there's been a software update. Yeah, because that's why I told them that you know, go into the dealership and try to find out if uh, the the they system can, can be upgraded. I'll tell them. You okay? No, it's and fine. I'll you, talk to them. When you come for the software update, you need we need your car for about half an hour. Oh, okay. And the car's going to stand and idle, uh, and they do the software. They update. do the software update. Yeah. Oh, okay. But no, you I'll can't go to gears. You can do nothing while it's doing it. Just, it's just it. idling, and yeah. then. Then we're going to go left over here. That's the difference as well. It's very low revving. You see, it's a very torquey motor. So with the 400 newton meters of torque, it's extremely low revving, uh, smooth, power. smooth power. And this gearbox is just assisting it. Because one thing I thought was 120 kilowatts though. Is it? But I, the supplement is on the torque. Yeah. That's always the case, especially with the diesel engines. You remember, a petrol motor develops power. Uh -huh. Diesel motor will develop torque more torque Yeah, because you need more pulling power yeah. anyway Because that's what you're going to be doing A good way of explaining it is a petrol car with lots of power Is how, how quickly you can run into the wall uh -huh. that's a With, petrol, the, with, with the, the, the petrol? petrol yeah. uh -huh. Uh, a diesel motor will be how quickly you can run through the wall because it's stronger. It's you stronger. <laughs> I hear keep you. Keep going straight. <laughs> See, I'll 
it's a bit of a bumpy ride, yeah? Uh huh. By the lane. Yeah, you see, you are across the line. There, where that white van's coming out, we're gonna go left. Now you'll see it won't warn you now uh -huh. because your indicator's on. Uh. Yeah. Front there on the bridge, we're going to join the highway. The highway. So even at high revs, how smooth the gearbox is. Uh huh. This gearbox is something else. Your phone? Yeah, it's fine. I've got it. All right. Where do I change the driving modes? You want to go to sport? Yep. There we go. It should be in sport. Yeah. Yep. Let me see the response now. Let's watch this tiny. Uh huh. Well, well, whatever it is. <laughs> gonna drive like it's driving now yeah so it should give you adaptive cruise control if someone comes in front of you too close uh-huh i see it's already breaking i'm not yeah, doing anything it's already yeah. said there's something in front of you so it's leaving a a space a, a decent gap and you see oh. what it does it's showing you yeah, how many like cars or something that's it how yeah much, how much space there is between the it's like one, two, three, four cars. It's driving itself now. You're not. You're not touching. You no, know, I'm not. My feet is literally yeah. just flying around. But in terms of the now lane keeping assist do, now. Now what you can do is you can take it a bit higher. Okay, let's see how it responds. Just use your throttle to pick it up. I can't see what speed you're doing. It's like 119 now. Okay, take it up manually to about 130. Okay. Done. There we go. Alright. I think it's reducing based on the car in front. Yeah. That's why it wouldn't accelerate, I think. Move. If the person moves, maybe it will. It's keeping you... Like, always four car, le four car right. lengths, yeah, basically. Exactly. It's even indicating here yeah, that it's for colors. You see now it's like it's always keeping that. So basically it's gonna be driving with this person in front of me. That's it. And that, then in terms of the lane keeping assist. It doesn't allow you to go all the way up. I want to see if it's gonna steer. It doesn't allow you to go all the way up to the person in front of you. Yeah. It's steering though. Yeah. It's just, it just feels so weird because now I'm like, hey, <laughs> I need to touch this. And it's doing like one Check thing. It's keeping the, keeping the line perfect <laughs> for you. Check. Uh -huh. You're not driving. Uh -uh. It's driving for you. I'm doing like 130. It's doing like 132 now because this guy in front of us is doing this. I need to see gap. when is it going to give up basically. It's keeping the gap. Yeah. Four car lengths all the and time. It's, and it's keeping you in the lines so, because this isn't a straight road. You see, it's yeah, curving. Yeah, it's curving. So it's automatically. Even with the trucks, I'm like, I'm just waiting to touch it. <laughs> so now it's doing 120. This is crazy because there are trucks next to us, and I'm like, because it's steering now. I can see that it's steering, yeah, not doing it's anything. Steering oh it's my god. But how long? Because it's been like so long now and I'm wondering... <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is crazy, man. These systems... 
they do crazy things, eh? And it's kept okay. you on the right-hand curve and the left-hand curve. Yes. What you'll have to do is just after the second track, go one lane You can across. go one lane, okay. Because we're going to now go on the Mavapani Highway. It it's Vietnam accelerating because there's no car in front there's of us. There's no now. car in front of you. So we're gonna go out here then. We're gonna go out here, yeah. Break and fly. You're blown away by the lane assistant. <laughs> <laughs> remember in the H6 we couldn't get it properly at, yeah, but at remember, the time. That's it, that's lane assist. This is a full lane assist. Yeah, that one just warn you. It's more lane warning. Uh huh. Now watch her. You're gonna press resume. Okay, back on. Thank you for the the throttle. Yeah, I want to see what it's going to behave here, how he's going to behave now. Check, what it Check does. the brakes! It's Check the brakes! Check the Check brakes! Check it's braking. I'm not doing anything. Also a brake. <laughs> yeah. Check there. It moved like so quickly from there to like 60. I'm just going to leave it now. Okay, as soon as you can change light. Oh wait, now there's something a, coming. There's a taxi here. Shows sure that there's a thing here. Careful, that guy's not Come gonna on, move over for you. Yeah. Okay. It should break now. Okay, I'm holding it. <laughs> you can leave the steering. Yeah, it's gonna because it's just driving now. And it's keeping the so distance. So if I guy. indicate now, will it change the lane? Yeah, you'll allow you to change the lane with a run change automatically. Because it keeps saying hold the steering wheel, hold the steering wheel, hold the steering wheel. Okay, now there we go. Just leave it now. Oh. Look at the Check, to Just leave it, don't uh -huh. do anything. Yeah. It's going to pick up its speed by itself. And it's saying hold it, hold it, hold it. I'm holding it and I'm leaving it so that it shows that there's a car now in front yeah. of us. Three. So it's like it feels more comfortable at four car lengths basically. Yeah, it wants that safety safety button. All the time, yeah. Now that's the law because the law actually says It needs to be two, four car lengths. I thought it's three. Two seconds. That's the actual takes that. law. Takes so when the guy goes over a line one thousand and one, one thousand and two, you see uh -huh. two seconds gap. Oh I see now. And you'll see the faster you're going, the two seconds will become a little bit bigger. A little bit bigger, yeah. yeah. Because then now it's your reaction time. That's it. So it's not about car length, it's about mm -hmm. time. The two time. Seconds, yeah. The time. It's not, I'm not driving today. <laughs> can leave the steering wheel. Uh -huh. Keep it in lane. You're the one driving. So let's see what this customer, this is the customer I was waiting for. Oh, okay. Doesn't matter. Let's see what she says. Uh, on you know this cab is one of the scariest that I'm like I'm ready okay you're braking by yourself now it's braking by itself okay now I'm scared okay, yeah. no 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 <laughs> don't take chances mm, mm, this tech I'm like oh okay okay I know I know you can work but you can take your foot off the brake now I mean, off the throttle. 
Uh -huh. So what you're going to see, check out school to your back? Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm seeing it now, focal lens. No, watch out, watch I want to see what it's going to do watch, now. Watch, Is it going to break? It's going to break, it's going to break. Don't ah. do anything. Break, break. <laughs> it's breaking, yeah. that was crazy. Okay. <laughs> oh man, that was crazy. <laughs> you didn't break it. Break, no, I didn't. Yeah. I, I thought, you know what, if it gets too close, then it's fine, I'll break. Because I believe then it will just... Yeah, remember it's now off the cruise control yeah. because it broke. Is so it? Yeah, it would have gone off automatically. All right. The minute it breaks, it'll go off. Oh. Whether you break or the system breaks, it'll. Oh, it will it'll go, go off. off. Yeah. That was crazy. So now it can do the the whole. Oh, it's showing me the cab now. And then in front. And you can set it. Okay, now we're going too fast again. Also, it's it's doing it when you are like a bit slow. Yeah. When it's on, you mm -hmm. can say go to the side, go to the front. Oh, okay. Go to, to the, the rear. Back. Go to the other side. Ah. Go to the front. I see. Oh, but it's speed sensitive basically. It's speed sensitive, it'll cut out. Come, Mas Lucky. Just look at his car, it's a red robot. Yeah, no, it's fine. If you observe, want to see what's behind you, you see? Uh -huh. So it's, it's just Suzuki. basically showing you everything you see around what's the car. Next to you. It's a taxi, you can only see the front wheel there. Yeah. You can see what's happening there with all the rubbish lying next to the road. Yeah. So basically, the assumption is that you can see high up, but yeah. you can't see like That's down there. Stars, yeah. no. You see it'll cut out. There you go. Oh, I see now. Okay, I can feel it's it's pulling longer now. Is it yeah, the eco? The eco, yeah. Trying to save fuel in the environment. Yeah. It's using less throttle, so it'll make it go a bit longer. Uh huh. Like we did before, you can go right over here. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, I'm gonna put it on normal now. Yeah, normal's the best. I'll So basically when you're driving on normal, this is how, if you're living with the P-Series on a normal day, mm. <laughs> this is how you're going to be feeling. This is how you feel. No revs, just smooth torque power. Alright. And these are what, the heated seats or whatever? Do you want them on? Does it feel any different? Do I even know? I just see people doing it, but okay, this is like driver heat seat off. Let's say hi. I don't want. So my bum is gonna be heated You're gonna soon. Start getting a hot bum now. <laughs> Just give it a while. You'll feel it. So it's it's only heated for the winter, but yeah, not ventilated for what is this? No, it's yeah, it's heating. Are we going? What is happening?
Okay, okay. My bomb and my bag are hitching up. <laughs> okay, let's switch okay, it off. Okay, we can switch it off. <laughs> okay, I didn't expect it to be like that. Yeah. I, I always thought, ah, oh, this gimmick. Side, you just pull in over there for me, please. All right. Okay. Just is like it, that is perfect. Uh, oh, it can check immediately. There we go. Perfect. 